What's up, y'all? It's your boy B-Phil back again in a toe win. All right, let's go ahead and take a look at yesterday. Trade review for 11, 5, or 12, 5, 22. Let's get into it. So yesterday we were looking for price to come back ultimately up into this zone. It did tap into the zone. It started to just fall off very, very slowly. As it was falling off, I came back and I looked at price because, you know, when I saw this, I was like, okay, well, if it breaks here, okay, so it broke here. So now where did, where did this low come from, this high? So I went in and I found a, a neat little zone. I was looking for price to come and tapped in, it tapped in. And this was a after the fact trade, by the way, after the fact. And so then I was looking at price and I was like, okay, well, where would I've gotten in this on lower time frame? All right. And I, I decided that more than likely this would probably be when I started to see this pull back a bit, I would have probably gotten in right here, take it down. And it looks like this ultimately ran nine RR. It looks like it's pulling back right now. So that's pretty much what happened yesterday. We we're looking forward to run this low here. And I still wanted to run this low here. So we'll just keep this, keep this going like it is right now. Um, price looks like it's coming back up there. Okay, it could be big in here somewhere, but we'll go ahead and go over that when we do our outlook. Let's go to the Euro. See what happened. Looks like the euro came down to this large daily zone. I believe this is a daily zone. Might be like, a, well, go back. We can watch the video. There we go. A one hour zone. And it looks like price came back in here. Now starting to break up. So if we were at the charts at that particular point in time, which was. Ah, you know, around midnight. So I wouldn't have been at that ch <laughs> the chart right now going into the London session. So it looks like we zoom in going to London. Equal lows here. And you have this really crazy breakup. And it comes back down. Break and be one. And then probably buy stop this. My music. You have set it for auto repeat. So buy stop that. Below this low. We take it up here, which I mean, if you look at the price that I mean it doesn't really have very much meat on the bone. It only has a four. So I mean this trade in its in of in and of itself doesn't look very good because there's not very much room to run before it comes back up here because I'm still expecting a short from up here. All right, let's look at the next pair. So that, that was pretty much that. Maybe I, I probably wouldn't have taken that. There's just not enough meat on the bone there. We didn't look at gold, we looked at Bitcoin, that's right. And we're waiting for Bitcoin to come down to the $16,524 level around that area. That's where we're looking for long trades. And it looks like we ended up just shooting up, breaking down, breaking down. Looks like now we're probably in some bullish price action right now. So, or excuse me, bearish price action. So that might be something to look at for our outlook. But anyways, that's going to be the review for 12.522. Hit the comments, hit the like button, and hit the subscribe button. Let's get it. Y'all have a wonderful day. Peace.